in San Jose under this tattered tarp sits the once majestic First Church of Christ Scientist. Advocates say years of neglect and a wet winter have taken their toll. It is horrible. It is as bad as it looks. The owner, ZNL Properties, had planned a development here back in 2014. It never quite got off the ground. And now the company's chairman sits on house arrest in London, embroiled in a bribery scandal out of San Francisco. This is a Chinese company that came to the United States with promise of development and luxury and has just left the city of San Jose holding the bag on one of the worst pieces of blight anyone can remember. City officials are understandably frustrated. They've been pushing ZNL to sell the property. The company's other San Jose sites are already on the market. ZNL did not respond to our request for comment. Up to this point, and there has been good faith efforts, even though it's terribly slow. The pandemic definitely did get in the middle, and the financing conditions didn't help. In the meantime, San Jose has begun the process of code enforcement. If ZNL doesn't take action, fines start mid-June. It's roughly a thousand dollars a day in this instance. The church, which sits on St. James Square, was built in 1904. It's been vacant for decades, something the Preservation Action Council wants desperately to change. We were founded primarily to save this building. They say it was a movie theater once and could be again, or a community center or a gym. But they say the church is worth preserving. So we are really pushing the city um, to, in any way they can, facilitate its transfer to an owner um, who has a vision for the project and the resources. Officials say first things first, the old tarp needs to come down and a new one needs to go up. They're hopeful the owners will let the city come in and do that in the next few weeks. In San Jose, Ann Rubin, KTVU Fox 2 News.